Okay, Nuvo Ceres. Sure, why not? I'm just kind of letting this go because this is this is interesting. There's stuff packed in here. I was really hoping Wander still had Kermit the Frog on. Sorry, I took it off because. Uh, honestly, Operator Prime looks so much cooler. Star Child, are you seeking revenge for its damage to me? Will you destroy this Umbra Warframe? No. The codes are in his memory. If I can get close, I'll go in again and try to recover them. He's the key to finding the Lotus. I can feel it. She lived through things. I'm impressed. Uh, let's see where. Oh, did they, did they already lock me in? I don't. Frankly, my dear, I don't care. Let's go this way. But yeah, Operator Prime looks awesome. And also, um, I'm going to be totally honest. The Kermit suit was really hard to die well. It looked, it generally just always looked bad. Which I know is exactly why I bought it. Because I was like, yeah, I get to look like a complete doof. Uh... But at the same time, sometimes I just enjoy looking like a cool spaceman. I like looking like a spaceman. Okay. These Grenier had a bad day before they met me. No survivors. I think he just blew up. Hello, Tentaball. Oh, you, they get to die kissing. That's cute. I didn't know Grenier swung that way, but I guess it kind of makes sense. I mean, I don't think they're genetically viable for anything else. Approach with caution. Oh, is that the first time I've ever seen an NPC Warframe fight anything? That's an interesting question. Now, Am I supposed? I'm supposed to stun it. Oh. I'm trying. Void blast, Star Child. Use it. I don't even remember now, the. Use transference. There we go. Hello. You move. Let's go. Comey, surround enemy stones to capture them. Block the enemy from surrounding your own. Diagonals are not considered. Capture three stones to win the match. I see. Go on. Make a play. Well, that was easy. He loves this game. I'll never forget the time I finally beat him. But now I'm thinking he just let me win. Hmm. I guess we did have a notable advantage last time. Uh, let's see. I've never played Go before, so my exact exposure to it is very limited. Probably going for that one. Curious. I don't understand the rules of what I'm doing. But that's okay. Someday I should probably study how, how go goes. Hmm. Okay, so walls walls count. And I think that counts as his territory to begin with, so... Your turn. 
while I lose. Mine. Yeah, rules on the left. Yeah, but like, block the enemy from surrounding your own. Surround, surround enemy stones to capture them. You served with distinction, old Dax. We commissioned a portrait in your honor, there on the wall. The sentient battle at Hall. I can't imagine. You were awarded the Lua Cross for valor. Will you follow in your father's path? Of course. He will. And his children will. You see, these are the stakes of this little game. Each stone I capture will be another, and another, and another, culled from your subversive bloodline. He will, and his children will. You see, these are the stakes of this little game. Each stone I capture will be another, and another, and another, culled from your subversive bloodline. You thought you could outplay me. I've had lifetimes to plan my defection. You spied on me, intercepted my communications. But I saw your move long before you took it. And so, we come to the consequences. <laughs> Father, you... you all right? Please, do something for him. Uh, Small child, uh, were you successful? I couldn't breathe. Somehow you are inverting the flow. Not from tenor to warframe, but warframe to tenor. There may be residual effects. Return to the ship. Oh god, we're on this tile set. Of course it gets goofy. Oh. We've got a uh, song fragment or whatever. There we go. I think I'm just going to kind of ignore that. I don't really have to fight these guys, and I don't really know if they drop anything. If any of you guys uh, know if I should be going after them, I'm all ears. Because honestly, like, they're not very hard. I just don't remember if they drop much. I guess they drop Ayatin stars. Oh, or no, sorry, intact sentient cores. But like, I can get those elsewhere much easier than this. My Atomos used to have much higher ammo capacity than this, but no, it's just burning through it really quick. Yeah, nothing really. Okay, cool. Because it's nice to just kind of zip fast at this point. I just want to see the plot. Bring the Helios to scan them. Oh yeah, that's a good point. Uh, I'll, I'll bring my Helios along. What if I ever made Helios Prime? I don't think so. I, I really like the artistry that they're going with on this one. The, uh, just, even the board game looks really cool. I've always thought that about, like, DE, that their, their visual design, I say this constantly whenever it comes to, um, everything. Hello, Warframes. Our hubris shone like a black star. For our technology, our war machines were your kin. How easily you turned them against us. We were forced to hold a means. Not circuits, nor light, but flesh and disease. Our horrors passed. Our ravaged outer colonies became gardens. So, this is the creation of the infested. In 
that case. So, the sentience turned the Warframes against them, or we... Or is... Who is talking here? I guess that's the real question. Is this a sentient talking to us? No, this is Ballas. We cultured the infestation, conceiving of a hybrid, transformed, but only just. The Helminth was created, born to yield these new warriors, worthy of battle against you, the great and terrible Hunhao. We took our greatest, volunteers or not, and polluted them with these cultured reagents. They transformed. They became infested. Yeah, so that's why there's infested ancients and so on and so forth. And they kind of have the weird orc and long arm and stuff. But only just. Their skin blossomed into sword steel. Their organs interlinked with untold resilience. Yet their minds were free of the infested madness. Or so we thought. We set them upon the battlefield. Biodrones under our command. The Warframes. All of them failures. Surprise. They turned on us, just as you did. And so we had no choice but to commit them to grave. This is all you know, Hano. But there is a hidden half. A secret that lies within a place forbidden to you and your kind. I speak of the void. Star Child, repairs continue. Allow me to test vestigial precepts for a moment. Like caring. Dear operator, you, you need to stop this. You could suffer permanent harm from Umbra's memory. What if you internalize all this? I, f I feel like he's leading me to the truth about Ballas. Right now, it's all I have to go on. I would still... I would love to play, like, a prequel game or something that actually shows these events unfold. Because, like, the cool part about this is not the gameplay. In fact, I almost want to say that the quests are some of the... Not the quest. The, the gameplay for the quest tends to be a little bit on the weaker side. Alice must be tracking Umbra now. I'm detecting increased sentient presence in the area. Because, like, for the most part, I'm just kind of zipping through these levels and stuff. And I'd actually love to play, like, the uh, Orc and Sentient War as, like, a game or something. That'd be rad. But with, like, cutscenes and, like, exact mission events. Oh. Oh. And these things take forever to kill. Which would do more damage? I guess I could test. The area is locked down. We need to take care of those mimics. That was fast. Like, I like uh, Warframe's gameplay. I'm trying to figure out how to put my words on it. Keep searching. They are here somewhere. And they just pop out and attack me, too. It's not like this is particularly difficult. What is that? Oh, yeah. I was like, what is, what is even going on over here? I don't know. I guess I'd really just like to he uh, see all these events actually unfold in person. Because it's, I mean, it's kind of cool doing the, like, mimic hunting and stuff like that. Screw you, camera. Oh, there's another one. They don't, they don't stay patient. They're just like, you're not coming after me fast enough. Come here, boy. Oh, that wasn't him. All right, that would be you. Lockdown there it goes. Very good. 
Now, where is that Warframe? Oh, brah. I got a f mind jack to pick. Uh, hmm. Operator, please be careful. He is not in control. Oh, I have to bleed, deplete his shields. Fine. Am I supposed to shoot him? Oh, I'm supposed to... I'm supposed to shoot him as an operator. I can't hit him otherwise. Well, this is awkward. Act. Okay. Oh, he just knows where I am. Well, I'm very glad that I upped my, um... I'm very glad I upped my my setup for this then. Because, yeah, I don't think I can hurt him with my regular weaponry. Yeah, no, he is... He is immune to all but the most uh, punchy of a uh, amps. He's almost done, though. Yeah, uh... There we go. Come on. Uh. I'm so glad I'm more or less invulnerable. You can still hit you if you're in void walk and whatever, which is stupid. Uh, Trouble dick. concentrating, old friend. Look at all your Comey stones I've taken. This one, a brother. These three, his children. And on and on, all of these go to the Jade Light. Father, do you remember your Shazin? Remember how you sing to us? Smiles from Jerome? How thoughtful to remind him of his better days. Come now, your move. Only a few stones left. So Ballas, or not Ballas, uh, Dax is probably, oh, oh, geez. Okay, I get the infestation. I don't get the rock. What's up with the rock that's growing out of everything? Or is that just what's behind the, the, the wall and stuff? Yeah, don't expect expert plays on the, uh, on fake Go. I've never played Go before. I'm just kind of looking at things here as we go by. But yeah, I wonder if Dax was, uh, part of the group that turned the, uh, the Warframes against Ballas. Isa, looks like your father still has his sharp wit. My father understands the game better than anyone. Yet you couldn't understand why I give my secrets to our enemy. How could I betray my own kind? But you have never had to sacrifice your love for faith. Imagine. To live forever with only one memory. Seeing the one you love die. Oh, Dax is a classification like Marine. Okay. But you would have to imagine a lovingly cultured infestation swarms within your blood. Your transformation has begun, reshaping you into a sacred surrogate of the unholy Tenno. A warframe with but a single burning memory. It is a miracle. But all miracles require sacrifice. He's gonna kill him. Who's going to what? 
Ballas. He's going to kill my... his... son, Isa. But aren't these memories, Operator? You cannot undo what has been done. See ya. I don't care about fighting you. If I can't kill you in one shot, you're not worth my time. Maybe that's why I don't like fighting the harder enemies in this game. Because I just enjoy kind of nuking whole hordes. Remember Hunhao was mentioned. Was that just a reference or the guy embodied? I don't think so. Because he was embodied as Umbra. Ballas and Hunhao are in cahoots. Evidenced by Ballas talking directly to him. Well, yeah? Ah, oh, man. I wonder if we... I would like to actually listen to the whole Vitruvian thing. Again, in sequence. Without the break, so I could understand it better. Because he's talking to Hunhao, who was the prototype... Tenno. And was pissed at us because... reasons? I've kind of... Unfortunately, it's been like, what, two years? Since, uh, I did Second Dream. I'm not a good plot analyst for the, this. I need to see Before them again. Before the vain faith, our people held dualism as truth. That all things were of two parts. Mind and body. Consciousness and matter. Of our world. And the void. It was from there that our answer finally came. That's a cool looking spaceship. Distorted by vague horrors, we kept the Zaraman survivors within a secret reservoir. They were the missing half. Transference linked. The Warframes the body. And they the mind. I give you now the coordinates and codes to this place. But do not underestimate these devils, Hanhao. They did what we could not. We had created monsters we could... I know what I have to do. Operator? I don't need to hear it. I lived it. Prepare the landing craft, Ortis. I'm going in. Myself. I hope that doesn't mean what I think it does. Well, this is a new one. So, this is... This almost feels like a prelude to what Second Dream was. Yeah, that ship was the Zara Man. Yep. Operator, please reconsider. You know how dangerous this is. The sentience will be here in force. This is why you bring a Warframe to these things. My Warframe is here. I just have to find it. How often do you plan on dying in the next couple minutes? Operator, we'll see. please be careful. He is not in control. This is not going to go well. God damn. Tano on their own are so slow. They're so just incredibly sluggish. Well. What am I supposed to do? Because he's just going to stunlock the shit out of me. Alright, whatever. He's Void Dash. Uh, you mean for speed? Or to... To stop him. Or to get energy back. Well, I mean, that was actually a lot faster than the last time I fought him. He wasn't as aggressive. He was much slower. Wow, I looked like some kind of weirdo Cyclops. Weirdo you punk Cyclops. You have lived this moment countless times. 
But our minds are linked now. We'll face this together. This poison he's given you, it has taken your will away. You are a victim as much as your son. Sorry, Isa. The time has come. We are together. I am honored to be your son. Thalys did this. Not you. Don't worry, old friend. I'm not going to kill your boy. You are. Father? Father! Whoa. Hello. Alright, we've gone full Oricon at this point, which is a problem. You never go full Oricon. I do like this shader, though. This looks really cool. Actually, hold, hold on. Can I can I switch sides? It's a oh, that's perfect. There is our thumbnail for this uh for the, a while. <laughs> This really does remind me of the Rain World ending to some degree. Except for it actually makes more sense. Oh hey, it's that tree we saw. Have been seeing. Oh. Oh, there he is. Oh. we couldn't control. We drugged them, tortured them, eviscerated them. We brutalized their minds, but it did not work until they came. And it was not their force of will, not their void devilry, not their alien darkness. It was something else. It was that somehow, from within the derelict horror, they had learned a way to see inside an ugly, broken thing. And to take away its pain. Huh. So wrath is white, acceptance is middle, and emptiness is dark. I legitimately do not remember what my current predisposition is, and I don't think I will ever remember. I don't remember if I was going neutral or light or... shoot. I don't think it even, like, changes anything. If we ever get to the point where it does change something, I'll see if I can, like, redo it. Let's see, my mouse is off. Is it? Oh, if my mouse is off, it'll go to what it is. So I'm currently neutral in that case. Well then, I think I'll just probably keep going pure neutral. And I'm just going to commit to it. I mean, I like an acceptance anyway. We accept this memory and move beyond its reach. I figured most people would go purist, so I figured I'd go neutral. 
Because usually neutral is the shitty option. Operator, you did it! Your transference signal is clean, synchronized with that warframe. Mark a path to extraction. We've got one last mission before this is done. Marking, but I'm detecting a mass of sentient forces converging on your location. Quickly, you may be able to escape. No. Let them come. And I assume I am... Oh, jeez. This thing is garbage. I guess I'm just gonna shoot it, shoot it with my hand fists. And what else am I supposed to do here? An unmodded ex Cal Umbra? Yeah, we do have a new- oh, it is just fighting. Oh, well that- that kind of changes things a little bit. He'll just fight for me. Wait, do we get the ability to have our Warframes just kind of fight for us while we're running around now? Because that would be really rad. Like, to be able to fight alongside it in the middle of that. Or is that just Umbra for this one? Because that would be hilarious. Use Exalted Blade. I was out of energy. Okay, I had a little bit left. But, like, it will die. If I, uh, let it run around free. <laughs> We're gonna... He is modded. Then why is he so easy to kill? Let's see, where is he? There we go. I guess I could just head for the exit. Though I will admit this is good EXP for my amp. There's probably better EXP for my amp. But still. Uses for him too. I have no energy. I don't have my um. Oh, that's a new one. But yeah, he is straight up dying. Otherwise, like I'm going to have to tank it with uh, I'm gonna have to tank it with my Tenno just because. Uh, otherwise, he's just going to die. He's pseudo modded. Check your arsenal when you get back. All right. It's just compared to say many of my other frames. Uh, I am very weak. However, uh, my Tenno is carrying it one hell of a shotgun. So it doesn't bug me too much. His mods are fantastic. Oh, so he has a new set of mods that he gets gets to carry with him. Cool. I bet they're just not upgraded. Also, we don't have any of the other mods-ish. Hell to max them out if you don't already hoard endo. Uh, that sucks. Uh, is there a new good endo farm, or is it still is it still really shitty? Because I'm gonna be totally honest, I have been sub 10k endo for like years now. <sighs> so you can roll as an operator and move faster. Ah, oh, good to know. Well, I think we're done with this. So let's see what we get. And then, I don't know, we figure out how to farm Endo. Seriously, if any of you guys know a good Operator, endo farm... we have no idea what Ballas is capable of. Please, reconsider this. Why would you risk it? Ordis. I'd like to hear her. Yes. Yes, of course. Accessing data store. Which should I play? Dream. Not of what you are. But of what you want to be. 
Operator, so there is much to be done. Please consult the navigation console. Oh, let's see, you can buy sculptures for two to five plat each. Uh, yeah, I could. Still kind of a pain in the butt. Okay, so we have the Exalted Umbra Blade. Let me take a look at the appearance for this sucker. So does he use the full Excal? Because uh, I actually don't like the Excal Umbra helmet that much. The rest of his skin actually looks pretty good. I've got... Ugh. I've got a couple of Prismo sets that don't look bad. Apex. Actually, oh, the scarf and stuff stuff is separate? Oh, in that case, the Apex skin looks really nice. Yeah, the scarf will always be there. In that case, we might want to get a little picky then. Yeah, the Proto Armor set also looks really cool. This is the set based on um, on the previous game that they made, uh, which name I it totally escapes me right off the bat. I wonder if I wonder if I could get that on my like Xbox One or something. Oh, we got a hop fix inbound. Yeah, the Apex skin would be rad. I think there's also like a, a mod pack. Yeah, Dark Sector. I think there's also a mod pack that you can get. Um, that gives you a really nice looking Excalibur skin. But I don't think I want it. I don't like the Kadudo skin because it's got that like weird hail. Uh, it's got that weird tail. I'm just not sure if I want to drop five bucks on a frame that I'm not going to use that much. Whereas I could probably drop the plat on this. Let's, um, let's rep, rep Dark Sector. Let's get the proto, proto armor skin. Oh, um, you know what? Is there, is there a bundle that this is in? No, doesn't look like it. All right, proto armor it is. How do you get Umbra? It just gives it to you. Straight up, like, real easy. Ooh, ooh, this will be interesting. Yeah, we got one more... Oh yeah, this this will look fine. We've got one more. Oh, it looks really nice and white too. Holy shit! Like the the scarf dies really well. Cloth sometimes dies really poorly in these. But let's get it, let's make it dark. I'm waiting for that hot fix to go away. And then we'll. We'll continue the story. Go dark red. Oh. Oh, come on. Oh, this sucks. So the, the really metal parts uh, don't die well. They, they don't have the, like, classic Orican look. And they also... That also includes the helmet. So I'm just going to keep that dark here. I mean, this looks actually quite fine. It just could have looked so much cooler. If it had like one or two more color zones or is like resorted just a little bit. Or something. Am I going to look at his mods? Yes. Yes, I am. I just wanted to look at whatever. Oh, we also get the Excalibur, Umbra, Noble, Agile. Oh, and that's just Excalibur. I like the Agile probably more than the Noble. So let's do Agile. Okay. We did get a new Regalia. Or no. Oh. Sorry, not a Regalia. It was a Sedona, which I'm probably not going to use. Which one was it? It wasn't... Uh, might have actually been that one. Oh, we get the Dax Sedona. Doesn't look bad, actually. As far as Sedona goes, it actually looks quite nice. I think this one might also be new new for me. I don't know. I've got a lot of new ones. I still really want to get the... Uh, I'm waiting for the hotfix to deploy before I do anything. So we're just looking at cosmetics. And restart to receive update. No. Which one? I like this one. I like this one a lot. It looks really cool. The other one that I really, really want to get at some point... And honestly, I could get whatever. I'm just haven't justified it. I also really like this one. I think I like I think I like this one better because it spins. 
Oh, well, we'll have to do that later. Okay, so the new Twitch ones were at the bottom of the list. Oh, were they? Or were the end of the list of the ones that I had? Yeah, so the ones that I was just messing with, Dax. Okay, well, I'm going to keep it off. We've already got the scarf. Actually, wait, hold on. There's a Cyandana I got to check. Isn't there a scarf Cyandana that you can get? I don't think it goes around your Warframe. What's this one look like? Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah, there's straight up like a scarf you can wear. It doesn't actually look very good. Where is the scarf? Can I? Because I, I want to see what double scarf looks like. Come on, double scarf. Where'd you go? I don't actually remember where where it is. What it, which one of the, what it looks like? Oh, this one's kind of cool. The like little backpack uh, jetpack situation. Is it this one? No, Rapala. You are. No, that's just a big flowing cape, which actually does look pretty rad. Holy crap! Actually, Rapala looks really good. But that's not the that's not the scarf I'm looking for. There's straight up like a, a weird scarf knot that you you can get. Is it this one? No. Hmm. I'm gonna be more focused on this than I'm at the actual frame. Yeah, because I don't think I own it. I'm very confused. Teplo. Okay. I'm kind of tired. Oh yeah, there is Teplo. I've just been looking past it. Yeah, I could double up on Scarf if I wanted to, but that is real glowy. Okay, well, never mind. Uh, let's see. So the last thing I was going to look at, now that I'm now that I'm done goofing off... Oh, and I've gone back to appearance. Upgrade. So we have Umbral Intensity. Uh, it's halfway built. Ability Strength Tau Resist. What the heck is Tau Resist? So... So, ability, strength, armor, and health. Oh, no, he's rank 30. Why was his health so low? I guess his health is just garbage. But yeah, these are pretty good. What happens if we upgrade them? Like, to max. Obviously, I can't afford it. I am so far off. So th that goes up to 110, which is practically doubled by the set resistance. Holy shit. And I, I think I can put that on anybody. So, like, I could... Oh, we're going to have to go get some endo. Because, yeah, that's 770% health. Wow. Holy. Can you imagine Umbral Vitality maxed out on, I mean, Nidus or Ineros? Would that, would that allow you to get up to 10,000 health on Inneros? Is that a thing? 